Hello everyone, I'm Natalie Kunzman, MD, and I am going to walk you through what it takes and how to do a telemedicine visit with me. Okay, so I will let you know that I grew up in an era where I went to college and did not even need to have a computer in college, so I am not the most savvy tech person, so you don't have to be worried if you are either. The process is extremely simple. So the first part of this is how will you find me? So my website is all small letters, nataliekunzmanmd.com. So that's strung all together, nataliekunzman.com. Now let's just say that you forgot what my website is. You can do a Google search and you could say things like Natalie Kunzman, or you could say things like functional physician or holistic physician. Now the registered address, even though I am virtual, is in Colorado Springs. So the searching is going to be much easier if you top it, type in Colorado Springs. However, there are many zip codes that I'm involved in in Pennsylvania and Delaware. So let me first explain also that I am not a primary care physician at that point virtually. I am not employed by any health institution. And with that in mind, I do not participate with insurances. But the good news about that is you do not need to be insured to be able to visit me. Obviously, the visits are cash-based, non-PAR, but when we are finished, and I'll explain this a little bit later, I will submit a super bill to you that you can submit to your health insurance if you have that. And sometimes they may reimburse for that. Okay, so nataliekunzman.com. Or you may have forgotten that. So you look at Natalie or Kunzman or MD or functional physician or holistic physician or integrated physician and you'll start seeing my name pop up easily to get you to my website. And the website is the key. Now, the beauty of this website and the virtual online platform is you will have the ability to have full autonomy to schedule your own appointment. So let me walk you through this. If you get to nataliekunzman.com, you will get to the face sheet, if you will, or the first screen of my website. So I will show that to you here. And you will see my lovely face and you can scroll across the top or you can scroll throughout the bottom. Now there is some redundancy wonderfully built into the system as you fumble along, if you will, to try to schedule an appointment. So if you look across the top, you will see a section called services. So if you click on services, the next screen you will see talks about the available services and of course, I gave it some broad based types of appointments, but in functional medicine, we address nearly every topic or whatever is happening in your body because it's a very individualized approach. So sometimes that may be a little confusing to you to figure out what type of visit to to schedule. I would like to let my previous patients know that if I saw you in any other health systems, you do not really need to schedule a new patient visit. You will need to supply me with information because we are building your chart from scratch and I no longer have access to the charts that you previously came from. So that being said, you can scroll through and see what type of visit you may need because a lot of you 
will have your primary care physicians, and I'm expecting that you have that as part of your team. And you may only need a certain niche, such as hormones or gut health or compounds or some mental health where it's time to uh, prescribe any medications or treatments or integrative approach to your mental health. And I certainly do a lots of that every single day. If you scroll down on that page, you will see a little button that says book. And what that happens at this point is it will bring up those exact visits that you need and you pick the one that you want to go to. So there's a little button on the side that will say proceed. So I just picked one that said proceed. And you now see my schedule pull up where you can pick a particular time block or a particular date to schedule your appointment. Now, just to explain the mechanics, what has happened on my website, once you schedule, it will take you to my electronic health record for you. Now, you don't have to know a lot of those uh, details and behind the scenes connections, but once you pick a time block, you will start giving information that is necessary to create a chart on you. So there's a few uh, bare minimum things that are required. It will be your identifying information, such as you, your date of birth, your address, your phone number, and an email address. And I need to know that, I need to tell you that as soon as you are in this, you are now in a HIPAA compliant platform where that information will only go to that health record. I wanted to show you that with the redundancy in the system, if you go to my website, again, nataliekunzmanmd.com, and if you go to my website and you get that front page again, if you forgot to go along the top bar to schedule services, you can go down to the larger bar in that green section that says schedule now. Schedule now will take you to those sections again that you can pick and proceed to schedule your own appointment. Okay, that's how to schedule, that's how to get in, that's how to become my patient. And that is the end of what you will need to do from the website portion. Now, you'll have to be a little bit patient because behind the scenes in the electronic health record, as it's trying to build your chart and make some verifications, some time will, will go by, but it will start auto-generating some forms for you to fill out for compliance. It will also auto-generate an intake exam, and it will also auto-generate a link to pay for that visit. Now, the visits are paid up front, and they will get reconciled before the day of your visit. And all of those things will happen behind the scenes, and you'll start receiving that information on your email address. Again, if you are scheduling, let's say, an acute visit where you want to be seen shortly, that process still will happen, but please take a, a little bit of time and let those things happen. The hyperlink is going to be very easy for you to click on. That gets you to the payment section, and that payment section will ask for a form of payment, which is typically a debit or a credit card, and those things will get satisfied. Within your forms that will come to you auto-generated, there will be a section in there 
that talks about your video chat. The video chat is as simple as the link will be on that email. And for those using a cell phone, it will be on your cell phone email. And I can also text it if that is necessary. And the day of your visit, you won't get a whistle, a bell, a flag, or anything like that. Just remember that that visit goes on your calendar if you put it there and you press on the video link and you will start seeing me on the screen and I will see you on the screen. Now, I want to let everybody know that I am not a fancy person per se, and I am casual and I am not corporate. So if you wind up running into troubles, there will be a way to text back and forth or email back and forth or send a message on my website that you're having difficulty. And we can do such things as other platforms and other ways. And I have secondary HIPAA compliant platforms if for some reason that particular day some of your technology is broken and we will always have a way to figure this out there are some simple things as well that if you need to change an appointment you can try to do that on your electronic health record but if you are having difficulty doing that get a hold of me and I can mechanically do that. Now, after your visit has happened and we've had our video chat and we've discussed our plan, I can send you our assessment and plan, which will go to your email, but it will also be in your new electronic health record. You will receive a link that teaches you how to officially get into your chart, which is super easy. And then we will have a messaging dialogue back and forth on your chart. So we can make sure that it is, these messages are also compliant and, and can have the luxury of time to communicate back and forth. One of the final links that you will receive after the visit has been completed is what is called a super bill. And some of you who are used to going to your primary care offices, uh, there is a super bill that winds up getting submitted. And in these days it gets submitted electronically. So you may not even know that that process is happening initially, but the super bill will line up the ICD codes that we worked on for the day and we'll have an official billing system that registers in your chart so you will always be able to access it but i also will submit it to you for you to print out if needed there are some other really cool things that can happen now that we are doing virtual visits i can get you to full scripts which may wind up being your medical grade supplemental platform and I can teach you what supplements may be good for your treatment plan. I will also typically be using Rupa Health and Rupa Health is a large electronic clearinghouse for us to order some of those really exotic tests that a lot of you are asking for with your gut health and your gut zoomer and your microbiomes. I use a lot of Genova Diagnostics and I can order that through Rupa Health, but for even some of the mycotoxins and Lyme and food allergen testing and food genetics and um, diagnostic genetic SNPs that can help us zero in and some of the nutritional evaluations and the organic acid testing and the hormone testing, I will direct a lot of those requests to Rupa and you and Rupa will be talking back and forth via email. So it's a really cool system to start diving in to those things you never really could address 
in the traditional healthcare system, your conditions may be not satisfactorily addressed because we got a lot of root causes causing them. And, and don't mistake, I am not afraid of medication and I use them freely because they are necessary to fix some pieces and I enjoy the compounding pharmacists and the pharmacies. So you may visit me virtually in Colorado, Delaware, or Pennsylvania, but the prescribing, you may be out of state and you may visit me in these states virtually, but the prescribing will be in those particular states, unless, of course, we are just dealing with the supplemental approach or some compounding pharmacies that are national clearinghouses. So the sky is the limit as far as functional and integrative care. I remind you all that I don't care what your health condition is, I don't care what your sex, your race, your persuasion, your medical philosophies, your vaccination status, I don't care who you are. This is a fully accepting platform where I am here without a template and I am coming to you with that open template to help you meet your health goals. I look forward to seeing you online. Hopefully this tutorial was enough, but if not, this is where my website and chatting and messaging can actually help you hone. Natalie Kunzman, MD. Now you can find me online in my virtual office full-time at nataliekunzmanmd.com.